right, everybody. Whoa. We're in uh, Homer, Alaska, actually just outside of Homer in Kachemak Bay. We're actually salmon fishing, getting ready for the uh, Homer King Derby tomorrow. But uh, as you can tell, this is not a salmon, okay? Uh, what we've done is we've actually, we're out here testing the new Chrome Pro Troller rods and our brand new Capstan 300 uh, trolling reel, casting reel. And we've hooked what we think is a halibut, and, a, and it's a good halibut. The first run was about 200 yards of 30-pound Caspro braid, one off the reel just like that. Uh, clicker's still on, so if I pull back a little bit, you'll hear it. But we've had this fish on now for a while, and I don't think he even really knows he's hooked. Like I said, I've only got 30-pound braid on, so I'm trying to be a little bit careful here. The reel is handling this fish beautifully. I've got the drag really light again because of the braid, but if I wanted to crank it down, this reel actually has about 35 pounds of drag, so we could we could stop him and lift hard, but I'm just a little bit worried. Yes, this is a pretty big fish. That's pretty interesting out here. I mean, we got ling cod, we got bottom fish, obviously a lot of salmon, but there's all kinds of thing that things that swim in this uh, Kachemak Bay, and we believe right now that we've hooked a halibut. And I know there's halibut out here that go, you know, well over 200 pounds. I don't know how big this fish is. Hopefully we're going to find out. And again, the rod is definitely not a halibut rod. This is a 10 and a half foot chrome pro troller uh, salmon rod. But I've got plenty of butt section strength. You can see this rod. It's got a nice soft tip for, for trolling with our flashers and our bait. But the lifting power is still exceptional in the strength of the butt. So I'm gonna see if I can get, get him turned a little bit. I'm guessing we still have about 100 yards to go. I love that bright orange strike tip. In fact, when we were trolling, uh, my granddaughter, Allie, was the first one to see it go, and I think that strike tip actually helped her identify it. There goes the reel again. He's going back down. <laughs> I don't know. If we land this fish, that will be a, a pretty good test, not only on the rod, the reel, and 30 pound Caspro braid for sure. We've got a little bit tough weather conditions today, but at least we're kind of in a, a little more protective cove right now. So the wind is blowing, raining a little bit, but not too bad. See if I can't get back a little bit of that line that I just lost. It's actually a little bit early in the year to catch halibut. That usually picks up around April, May, and of course all through the summer months, but um, that is some good eating fish if we're able to put this in the boat. I think I'm just making him mad by winding down on this reel. Well, we're gonna put a little more heat to him because he's using that big flat body down there. Oh yeah, he didn't like that. We're getting close, guys. We've had him on now for about 20 minutes. I can see Flasher. I'm going to reel down a little bit more, and I think uh, we've got to be careful. We're, we're probably going to have to turn the camera off here in a second because when he uh, breaks the surface, then all heck is going to break loose, and it's likely to go right back down 200-plus feet again. But it's definitely a halibut, definitely a halibut. Not a giant one, but a good fish. He'll go... Uh, 50 plus, maybe 75 pounds. Ah. There we go. Now, that was about 20 minutes of work on the new Cast King chrome rods and the new capstan reel. This halibut, I'm guessing well, we'll weigh him here in a second. 
about 65 pounds, I'm guessing right now. So it's been a heck of a day. Salmon fishing, and we end up catching this beautiful halibut. Again, Kachemak Bay outside of Homer, Alaska. Uh, getting ready for the Homer King Derby. And we end up catching a beautiful halibut. I'll tell you what, there's some great eating right here. And again, I want to thank my granddaughter, Allie, for seeing that rod go down. She was the one that was paying attention and uh, helped us put this beautiful fish in the boat. That was a heck of a fish. I mean, he ate that herring so deep, both hooks are buried all the way down in his mouth. And uh, Captain Reel, casking chrome rods, performed absolutely fabulously. I'm going to try to get him up a little bit higher for you here. That is a heavy, heavy fish right there. Halibut, Kachemak Bay, Alaska. And he's still got some fight in him too. <laughs> Holy smokes. Okay.